Hope Tech is currently under construction on the East Valley Institute of Technology campus. It will allow students transitioning out of the foster care system with a safe place to live, but it will also allow them to learn a trade in one of 50 programs. We wanted to look at what was the most underserved, undersupported uh, subgroup of students in the state of Arizona, and what we found it was foster youth. National research shows that children in foster care are at high risk of dropping out of school and are unlikely to attend or graduate from college. Part of the reason why they don't have a year 13 plan or why there's that real challenge is they don't have a safe place to live. In 2022, state lawmakers allocated $10 million for EBIT to build the residential center called Hope Tech, housing 16 students to start and eventually 64. By providing a home, Superintendent Dr. Chad Wilson believes students will have the foundation to get a career technical education, like aviation, engineering, cosmetology, nursing, and much more. Not only do we want to change the life of the, the foster youth that we're serving, but in doing so, do we have a positive impact on their children and their children's children? And does this not does this become a, a kind of a systemic change um, for generations to come? Caitlin Tejas is a medical assistant instructor at EVIT. She was in the foster care system herself and knows how difficult it can be for teens aging out of the system. We help them build their resumes. We help them uh, practice mock interviews. We prepare them for their real interviews. We even help them uh, by providing career fairs. She strongly believes Hope Tech will change lives. I don't want there to be students that we're missing out on. I know there are um, many brilliant students that slip through the cracks, and I just want to help catch them. Hope Tech is expected to open in July, and they're already in the process of interviewing students who will be able to live in these apartments. Reporting in the East Valley, Alexis Dominguez for Arizona's Family.